What is going on guys? We are back and today I'm going to show you a way to level up fast at the start of the game and get unlimited blood echoes in Bloodborne. First, if you already have game saves, I would recommend uploading to the cloud or saving to a thumb drive just in case. So I'm doing this on the PS5 to show you it still works to this day. I turned off internet so there's no updates as I'm playing the vanilla game of Bloodborne. You want to make sure there's no updates or patches on the game. So if you see version 0 in the bottom right corner, then you're doing good so far. In order for this to work, you do need to make two game saves. So start up a game and all you have to do is die or get to the first lamp so you wake up in Hunter's Dream. Then you can quit out of the game and start a new game. For this next one, you have to get to the first boss, the Clerical Beast, as it will give you what's called Insight, which is required to unlock leveling up. You can just let the boss kill you, which will wake you up in Hunter's Dream. Then exit out of the game, load up the first game. We are then going to the Merchant Stand in Hunter's Dream which you can purchase pebbles, which are needed for the glitch. So buy one pebble, then head back in, you'll see a giant storage box. We will put the one pebble into the box, as you can see. There is nothing else at the moment in the box. Then we will quit the game and load up the second game. Now we will get some money to buy some pebbles on this account. If you already have currency, you can skip that part. Now one thing you will need is cold blood dew, which is found very early on in the first section. We will head back to Hunter's Dream and straight to the storage box and put the cold blood into storage. Now is the part where we trick the game. Remember how we put the pebble in the storage box on the first game save? Well what we're going to do now is buy the max amount of pebbles on the second account and it will duplicate whatever we put in the storage box in the second game. In this case we put the echoes in the box so when we buy pebbles from the vendor it will put more echoes into your storage. So buy the max pebbles from the store and you'll see a message saying it's over the limit and the extra has been put in storage. So go back to the box and press R2 and should switch to the box inventory as indicated in the top right corner. Now you will see all the extra pebbles that went into storage and now converted into echoes. Now one thing you should keep in mind is that when you take echoes out of the box to use, always keep one echo inside so you can continue the glitch. So I have 28 echoes, so I'll take out 27 echoes. You can continue to buy pebbles from the vendor and continue to duplicate them as many times as you want, as long as you have the one item still in storage. You can use this for any kind of echoes, small or large, or even some consumables. So hope you guys liked that and it helped you out. Don't forget to click that like, share the video, hit subscribe, peace and love.